right, so today is Monday, October 1st, and we have a game this evening versus um, Zakia and Elitis Lithuania. All right, so the last vlog that we did, you know what I'm saying, we were just, we had our game on Friday versus Zorugus Varadauskas, and then we were following up Saturday with the game um, versus Jonova, Jonova, sorry. That's one of the cool things. I, I feel like I've learned so many small things about Lithuania since we've been here for about almost about eight to ten days. I don't know. I've been here for a while. It's uh, it's been exciting. I feel like I'm, I'm immersing myself in the culture as much as I can. But I will say that even just being over here in Europe, there are some things that are very different. Uh, the breakfast is super different. Um, even being in Poland, when the week I got up at the hotel, and I'm thinking, yo. We finna get lit with this breakfast. I'm expecting sausages and bacon and uh, omelets and all of this stuff. And then it's not that. It's just something completely different. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure it's good, but it definitely has taken my taste buds a while to warm up to some of these uh, delicacies that we've had since we've been over here in Europe. Especially when I think that I'm finna, finna touch down with a big old couple links of sausage. And I go look at them and there's some kielbasa, but it's just something different. Everything is a little bit different. Even like using the bathroom, we are on the um, on the highway. We stop at a rest area and they have a machine set up where you have to pay to use the bathroom. Just a little bit different. I feel like when you go to the bathroom in America and you hit the stall, it's like, you know, you got some privacy. But they mess around with extreme privacy. It's like you get your own little room. We touch down in a little public restaurant. I would say that one of the most interesting things to me is how interested a lot of these people are in American culture and politics. So in every country, every time we go out, somebody asks me about the national anthem protests and Colin Kaepernick and what's happening with that. Somebody has something to say about Donald Trump. We were at the mall in Conus, and let me give you a cap on this. So we had our game on Friday, and typically we're staying way out in like Racine or somewhere, but we went to Konis for one night, and then Konis is the second largest city in Lithuania, second to Vilnius, which is the capital, and then so we got to see that stuff, and we got to go experience some nightlife, and then they have this huge mall called Acropolis that we went to, and this guy like followed us around the mall, and he talked to us for probably about 20, 30 minutes about Trump, politics, and it's not the first conversation that I've had with somebody out here who has like expressed to me the concern or like let it, wanted to let me know that they don't understand why black people are treated certain kind of ways in America and they don't feel that way here or them personally don't. But I'll also add that I have heard from then other people who are like, you go to these big cities like um, Konas or you go to a big city like Vilnius it's not that crazy or they they're more accepting than if you go to one of these smaller cities i don't know we've been in this small city but we've been kind of like super secluded here and where we're staying at but um i will say what's funny to me is what that night that we spent in konas was like the first time like we were out somewhere and it felt like we were in like america a little bit where we went to like this club in Konis is like the big university. Felt like we we're in a typical like PWI, like college campus party. You know what I'm saying? Where the 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 only like black folks in there was like the little group that I came in with, and and it just you know how it is. You know, it take you an extra like five minutes to get a drink. Bartender serve everybody around you, and you like yo, like what's going on? But, you know what I'm saying, that, that's one thing. I will say though, there are some dope people out here, some really good people who have been like helping us out a ton. And uh, for example, when we were in Konas, we stayed in that hotel just for one night. And I messed around and left my suit in the um, in the hotel like wardrobe. And then so I didn't realize it until we got all the way back to our other place, which is like maybe 45 minutes in the middle of nowhere from Konas. Then I went here to the, to the little restaurant, tried to order some food, and realized that I left my credit card in the mall in Konas, you know what I'm saying? So so I was out of gas, but um, Sunday night, um, I, if you've been following my channel for a while, especially going dating back to the, the old channel before the rebrand. So there was a dude named Romnus Kilaviriskis, we call him Rom Kilo around here now, but uh, 
he was a dude who whenever there was some type of article that came out here while the Ball Brothers were playing over at Vitotas, he would like send it to me and translate it and all of that stuff. And I gave him a couple shout outs on my channel. But he came out here Sunday night and hung out with us at our little facility out this way. And then dope shit is he brought, uh, he brought four buckets of fried chicken, um, a half a dozen of donuts, some Pepsi, some Sprite, and all of this stuff, and kicked it. Plus, he hooked his laptop up with the uh, NFL Sunday Game Pass. You know what I'm saying? So we really had a like moment of us just chilling out here. You know what I'm saying? In uh, in Lithuania, but it felt like we was back at the crib. But the dope thing was for our game tonight on Monday. He already said that he would go to the hotel in Conus, pick up my suit, and also go to the mall where I left my credit card at and then bring that bad boy out to me. So I appreciated that, man. But so like I'm saying, there's some dope people out here, but uh, it's been interesting, man. There are a ton of like little things that are definitely different and the quirks are, are there. But man, it's a beautiful spot, man. And we out here and it's Liddy and Liddy.